Hey, Zach here from digitalconstructive.com, and today we're going to be taking a quick look at how to pass your General B Building Contractor License Exam. Now, the General Building Contractor License Exam will include sections that will cover planning and estimating, framing and structural components, core trades, finished trades, and safety. And if you're unfamiliar with the General B, you're absolutely going to want to watch our previous video where we break the classification down in extreme detail. Today, we're just going to be taking a look at the examination. Now, when it comes to California contractor licenses that fall under the C specialty classification or general A or general B, you'll also need to pass your CSLB law and business exam, which will include sections covering business organization, business finances, employment requirements, bonds, insurance, and liens, contract requirements and execution, licensing requirements, public works, and then of course safety. So essentially, you've got to pass two exams, 115 questions covering law and business and 115 questions covering general building. It's going to be multiple choice, closed book. You'll get three hours to complete each section. It's going to be computerized, and you'll take it at a CSLB testing facility. So you will need to come to California and actually take the exam if you're somebody that's applying from out of state. Now, we've got a free guide that breaks the entire licensing process in California down from A to Z how to fill out the application correctly, the top sample questions, uh, the different scope of work requirements, everything that you'll need to know. You can check it out in the top right-hand corner. Now, the general building specialty portion of your exam is going to be extremely critical. There's a lot you're going to be tested on, including plans and specifications, scope of work and code compliance, construction error identification, project coordination, job costing and estimation, subfloor and wall framing, roof framing, plumbing, electrical, HVAC, and concrete, earthwork and surveying, painting, interior, wall covering, tile and stone, cabinetry and millwork, plaster, drywall and ceilings, floor covering, landscaping, blueprint reading, and then of course Cal OSHA safety regulations. Now, there's a lot more that's going to be on this test. This is just a snapshot of what you kind of need to know and the type of uh, questions that are going to be on the exam. Now, remember that core trades represent 30% of this test. So that's about 34 questions related to plumbing, concrete, electrical, and framing. Now, when it comes to the mathematics for your general B license, make sure that you're tight with your arithmetic, obviously. So addition, subtraction, multiplication, and division. Um, be familiar with Watt's law and Ohm's law for the electrical-related questions. Obviously, calculating square footage. Know your different units of measurement. And then, of course, job costing and estimation will always draw from percentages and decimals. So make sure that you have these kind of core math skills in place. Now, when it comes to preparing for your general B license exam, California law and business represents about 50% of the test. So it's going to be extremely important that you go through all of the different sections of the law exam. Um, know your general building trade fundamentals and know the possible questions that could come up there. Uh, Cal OSHA health and safety codes, laws and regulations. California takes health and safety, environmental safety, workers' rights extremely seriously. So it'll represent a significant portion of your exam. As I said before, have your fundamental math skills down. So know the common equations, the common formulas. Have some test taking experience. So timed exams with flashcards, answer explanations are all extremely helpful. Walkthroughs of the exam with licensed general contractors and lawyers that'll help you decipher the language um, and really understand not only what you need to pass the test, but also how to run a profitable general contracting business in California. All of this is included with our General B license course. I really hope that you found this video helpful. If you have any questions, feel free to drop them in the comments below. Again, my name is Zach from digitalconstructive.com and thanks again for watching.